Hi, I'm Sarah Brennan. I'm Positive Business Director for Pentland Brands. Uh, that's a family-owned business. I think the themes that have emerged across the two days have been the interconnectedness between looking at issues around the environment, such as uh, the biosphere and um, what we're doing from a sustainability lens, but also what we need to do from a, from a people lens as well, so how that you can't just focus on one without, without looking at the other. It was really interesting some of the conversations that came out when looking at gender and, and the role of gender in, in family business and, and how that then plays out in, in the wider biosphere as well. Hi, my name's Professor Helen Trigidja um, and I'm one of the co-directors of the Centre for Research into Sustainability, which is a cross-disciplinary or interdisciplinary research centre at Royal Holloway University of London. Well, the two days have really been an open conversation amongst a really diverse group of uh, researchers and practitioners drawing on family business and resilience and I think by its very nature has just led to a, a large number of different um, areas. For me uh, some of the key were around challenges and that started because um, of the opening presentation around resilience and, and the biosphere. Um, so challenges being one and the other being scale and the need to work across multiple scales and, and, and across multiple areas. The distinctive aspects that's emerged for me is the need to take an intersectional approach to this. I think if we, if we don't do, look at the interconnectedness and the intended and unintended consequences, we can end up where we operate in silos and I think this is where today has been fantastic is having the different academic disciplines come together and look at it from a multidisciplinary lens but also in inviting family business and some examples from family business along so that we can we can all come together to helpfully perforate some of those silos that we're perhaps currently working in. So some of the things that have, have emerge from the conversations that I think are, are quite, for me, were a bit distinctive, were the idea of the importance of place. And, and while I think that that is something that we often consider, we've really had some uh, quite big conversations about the importance of place, uh, and that's important socially, for community, and also for the environment. Uh, the other one is around collaboration and, and the need to uh, collaborate and I think the openness of the conversations, the willingness of people to, to engage um, has meant that uh, the openness and, and collaboration is really, has, has been really important. I think the themes that have emerged across the two days have been the interconnectedness between looking at issues around the environment such as uh, the biosphere and um, what we're doing from a sustainability lens but also what we need to do from a, a from a people lens as well so how that you can't just focus on one without without looking at the other it was really interesting some of the conversations that came out when looking at gender and and the role of gender in in family business and and how that then plays out in in the wider biosphere as well I know a lot more about family business than, um, than I did before the seminar and uh, also the similarities of some of the discussions that are being had in family business uh, that are had in other areas of responsible business or social enterprises. I think the next steps are to keep these conversations going, to, to provide that, the platform to have the different disciplines in academia and the different disciplines in business come together because I think it's through that collaboration that we can really get into some of the issues that we're facing as, a, as, as, a, as individuals but also as businesses and as institutes um, as we're trying to tackle some of the big challenges. Uh, that are going on around the world currently. So let's keep this conversation going would be my advice as next steps. Well, I think the next steps in the conversation um, will be, would be to continue with, with what we've um, discussed in the last few days, but also perhaps bring in different groups as well. So I think one of the benefits has been the diversity of participants and so other community groups, uh, other groups that were perhaps not represented uh, in today's or the last two days discussion would be, would be great to see those opened up to, to more and more.